So Elaine, can you tell me a little bit about what got you interested in predictive analytics? As I started working with analysts and some of the actuarial students, it became very clear to me that they had a lot of skills that I was lacking. Right? They're much better at Excel than I ever was, and they've started using these methodologies and processes that I've never even learned. And so it became apparent to me that I had to go backwards and start learning what they already learned. One of the reasons you took the certificate program was to kind of catch up to some of those young folks yeah. who are learning all these things. Uh, have you? A great advantage is that I understand the language that they're speaking to me now. So they're using different models and, and I get uh, what they're talking about, the challenges that they're facing when they're trying to deal with the data or get the models to work properly. And also I might be able to apply the business knowledge that I have and make suggestions about which models might work a little bit better because I do know which ones fit more towards different solutions. And in the work you're doing today, can you give us an example of an analytics project uh, where you brought those skills to bear? So my company right now is working with a lot of hospital systems, and hospitals right now are faced with the challenge of providing high quality care to patients, but at lower cost. And so a lot of them are looking at care management programs where can they offer a patient better care um, in a more efficient way. And so using predictive analytics to churn through their past patient data and look for ways to reduce cost, reduce wasteful um, care and services. That's kind of what we've been getting into. So your experience with the certificate program, how has that helped you uh, adapt to the changes in the industry where you're consulting in the healthcare industry? So in healthcare, data is huge right now. There's so much data not and from various different sources, not just from one place. And so the analytics and, and the skills that you learn in the course help you deal with massive amounts of data, processing all that data, and putting it all together. It, it goes from the nuts and bolts of receiving data and putting it together to the modeling and what you do with it after. I think right now, uh, healthcare is a booming industry and there's a lot of risk sharing and risk transfer going on between the traditional insurance companies, the government, and hospital organizations. And so I can see actuaries moving out of the insurance field and out of the government field and working directly with hospital systems, helping them assess risk, helping them use their predictive analytics to better deliver care to patients. When other actuaries ask you about your experience learning predictive analytics and the certificate program in particular, what do you tell them? Well, I think this is a great time for actuaries. I think we have so much data in the world now, and we were used to dealing with uh, such a small slice of data. It's so robust, and to take advantage of the program and learn the skills necessary to be able to use all the data that's available to us, I think is really key.